Well, good day to all. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Brad the DC Universe Geek. For those of you who may be new here, today I'm on the floor. Why am I on the floor? Because I have this here box to open with you. It's box day! That's right. Look at my circular ring. You know what this circular ring reflecting off the box shows you? That I have not yet opened this world's finest the collection box yet. So I don't know what's on the inside. I've tried to be a good boy so I don't spoil it for myself. Sharp implement of cutting. The theme of this box, if I'm not mistaken, is actually Green Lantern Blackest Night. I'm pretty sure that that's what it was. But we'll know once we open it up. I mean, the front of the box having the black hand on it right there. By my black hand, the dead shall rise. And the back having Hal Jordan with a bunch of, you know, dead black lanterns around him kind of makes it a bit of a dead giveaway that this is the blackest night box anyway let's open this bad boy up so without trying to peek on what's on the inside because you know i don't like to do that there's the card putting that over there we have something drumsticks oversized chopsticks i have no idea what that is Oh, I think I have an idea. This is going to be one of those doohickeys. Oh, cut. Really? It did that? <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> and now I have a whip. This is going to be one of the. Oh, I was wrong. Okay. It's a wall tapestry. We have many tapestries. So this shows the full lantern spectrum here at least the lantern spectrum at the time there are currently more colors in the spectrum it takes all kinds doesn't it i thought this was going to be one of those window pulley things you know like for your car so that you know you can go to sleep without the sun blaring on your face you know what i'm talking about one of those doohickeys so that's very cool that is a wall tapestry i will definitely find a place for this what else is in the box the mystery box of fun. We have something small. It's little. And it's... Oh, wow! Ooh! Now this is cool. Here, let me just put a picture of it up on the screen. It's a black lantern ring. Oh, yeah. And, and, this bad boy fits on my finger. I can be a black lantern. I can have my own army of zombie lanterns filled with the rage and bitterness of one who has died and no longer sees the light. It came in this like half box with a black lantern emblem on it. There must have been more to the box. I feel like the box opened up. Culture fly sticker. What's this? It's the t-shirt! And I told them that I'm a 3XL, so this will definitely fit. This will fit one <clears throat> such as myself. Does it look cool? I can't see it from here. <clears throat> oh, right on! It's Hal Jordan with the rest... Oh, it's the same picture as the back of the box, just in t-shirt form. Yeah! And it's like a, like a black tie-dye. This actually matches. This is really cool. I like this. So three items so far in this box are actually really cool. So far, nothing that I would say is just like filler yet. What else is in here? What's this? This is a beer cooler. That's way overexposed. Look, here's a picture of it. Yeah, that's what it is. You're supposed to put your beer bottle in there. I must admit, I drink beer out of the tall cans. This is a hop house lager told you all about it. One of the finest beers on the market. Hmm. I suppose if I don't do it up all the way, <laughs> I could squish my can in there. <laughs> It'll keep it cold for the duration of filming, I suppose. What else is in the box? We have a hockey puck. No, we don't. We have coasters. That's hilarious. These my friends, are coasters of multiple colors of the emotional spectrum. Heck yeah! I have noticed that there is no green. However, <clears throat> doesn't my beer can look kind of naughty? Like the, the top zipper is 
is undone, exposing the beer cleavage. Okay, I know for sure there's one more item because there's always a figure, a little statue, but there is something else, also a badge. There's always a badge. And it is a white lantern badge, which would explain why there's no white lantern cozy. Cozer. Can I just say this? I'll just start this again. Which explains why there is no white lantern coaster. I do like this brightest day pin very much. You can't see it because it's overexposed. No worries. Here's a picture. Okay, so there is only one more item. I can tell because there's the uh, silica gel package that you're not supposed to eat and just the box. So let's look at the inside of the box. Whoa! Inside of the box is pretty cool too. And here's the figure. Atrocitus. This is cool. I like this. I like, I like these little figures. I know a lot of people are like, they just think the figures look cheap. And I suppose some of them have turned out looking kind of cheap. But I do like these. I wish that you could buy these like just in the store for like, you know, I don't know, six, seven bucks per figure. I think that'd be awesome. Here's some Atrocitus artwork on the inside. And here's the figure and the base. Very, very cool little statue of Atrocitus. Here's some close-up shots of the statue. Now remember, this is just one item that comes in a box with multiple things in it. And I would think that the street value for this would be under 10 bucks and you would find it probably in, I don't know, a, a toy store or in like a collectibles store. As you would probably find all of this stuff for like five or 10 bucks a piece in a store like that. I do like these boxes very much. If you're someone that is interested in these DC boxes, these World's Finest the Collection boxes, pop on over to Culturefly and sign up for a subscription. And no, they didn't ask me to say that. I just have so much fun opening this stuff all the time that if you're having fun watching me open them, maybe you'd have fun opening one yourself. I don't know. Okay, let's do a final recap of what we got in the box. We got the Atrocitus statue, little mini statue there. We got the beer cozy that is really supposed to be over a bottle, not a can. And then we got the coasters. And then we also got the white lantern, brightest day pin. We got the wall tapestry here with some lanterns from the spectrum. And we got the fantastic t-shirt, love this shirt. And we got the black lantern ring. Bleh. Not a bad spread, if I do say so. A pretty good amount of stuff. Everything here I think is actually really cool. There's not one item that I got this time around that I'm like, well, you know, it kind of sucks. I will use all of this stuff. Absolutely all of it. So thanks, Culturefly. Good on you. This box has been fantastic. But anyway, that's all the time I have today because my battery is going to die. I can see the red light of doom flashing. So I better go. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.